Honda? I fucking sunk it, dude. Hello? Hello. Anybody in there? Yes. Is there any water in here? There is no water. No? You're a piece of shit. You're a piece of shit? <laughs> Insert whale noises here. Uh, ooh. <laughs> <laughs> got it. Sorry, yeah. so we're out here today. We've oh. got All right, Mr. Brady. BP. Mr. BP. Mr. was clean. <laughs> We got Mr. Braden Price is out there. We got Mr. Miller's Braden Price right on uh, rancher. I feel like Mr. Whistling Diesel's cameraman zooming in and everyone idiot, idiot. I was idiot. talking to him yesterday. Oh yeah. We gotta come riding. I said hell yeah. Get out here, Freed. Yeah, Clayton. Freed. Idiot, idiot, idiot. Get your idiot self out here. <laughs> All right. What does that say? That says busted, busted. knuckle fabrication. This busted is a nuts. North Carolina produced rag kit that is not a hundred percent meant for this. But it looks great. What's it made for? It's meant for like if you have metal racks and I don't have metal racks, so I got these stupid ass links racks. Yeah. So I need my boy Cold Dean to build me a front rack so I can actually properly mount that. Ooh. Dude, your phone yeah. is so bad. Leave, leave my phone alone. The camera works great. Mr. Braden, is it look we should we film I think we should film on a phone from now on. Wait. It's on your knee. Oh shit. Oh you sneeled and gum. Oh that's gum, <laughs> there's no doubt. Ew. Who spat their gum out already this morning? Is it like right? Yeah, it was yours. Cause you're kneeling right there. Just a second. He kneeled in his own gun. Fuck. Are we making like a fucking calendar right now, or what? Let's make a calendar and send it to Gary. Let's do it. I feel like this is the way you're supposed to do it. <laughs> is that how it is? That's. It looks like you got really big pants. <laughs> Woohoo! Well, I'm gonna do some cinematics for you. We're doing cinematics, Kyle. The cinematics of I sprayed a little bit of SC1 right here. And nowhere else on the floor? All right, Braden with your dirty helmet. Yeah, I usually play this one. <laughs> oh my god. What happens when you're doing wheelies at 60? Braden. For you? Nothing. For Look how zoomed in I am. I like how zoomed this is what this is what whistling diesels do, dude. Whistling diesel? He just goes new, new, new. Is this thing on? Is this thing on? Hello, tap tap. <laughs> I was gonna be like tap tap is that thing on? <laughs> is this thing on? I tap tap tap. tap. <laughs> Boy just video. dropped my phone. I launched it. <laughs> <laughs> Freaking go. Oh. Right. Anyway, let's well, ride. Today, today's episode of Jackass. Honestly, dude, look at me, <laughs> man, with the iPhone Pro. Freaking, I can't believe he still talks to us with that fancy stuff. Yes, yeah, iPhone 12. You got the AirPod Pro, so you can ignore the rest of us. No, core. no. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I got this awesome hair light coming through there. Oh no, right through your. Where's it at? Come on. Tilt your head back up, idiot. Not all the way. There you go. What are you doing? It's not how you wear it. <laughs> go! Wait, 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 go! There's a four behind you! Oh my god. I gotta figure out how to start it. Go! Wait! How the hell? Oh my god! Oh, yo! Yo, yo! Oh, real! Oh, oh, that's not good. Oh, bro. Are you serious? Hey. Oh, you fucked mine up too. Yeah. Oh, oh brother. I definitely messed his up worse. Ooh, spicy. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the boat brothers are here. I feel like Brain's going to get mad if you keep filming me. Thanks, man. Let's keep looking at him. Pull up right here. See if you know what he's doing. See if you know how to ride four wheelers. What do you think he's doing? What? Do you, what, 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 what? <laughs> <laughs> See what? The last time you ran into somebody, you did this. Stop driving away, Beavis. I'm trying to look at your freaking bent bumper. Look, he bent Beavis's bumper. Don't be stealing my footage. I'm, I'm videoing. I'm videoing. <laughs> You're lying. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like since we have waiters on, we should go over there and go sit in that puddle. I got a clapped unit over here. So I cut my skid plate off because it was getting ripped off anyway. It's the, I haven't washed it since last ride, so all the seaweed's still wrapped up around. But what else? It's the water in the headlight. It's a loose bumper for me. What do you think? What do I think Peppa. Don't put her in there. Yay! Oh! <laughs> Single file line, people. Wow, my steering is really messed up. My handlebars are like tilted to the left. I don't know if you can tell, but this uh, this girl needs some loving. Okay, we're turning left. 
Turn left, people. Holy shit! <laughs> Just got some air off of that. We both sit over that. Damn it! Wow, bro. <laughs> What'd I even break? Yeah. Your tie rod on the side. Damn it. Broke tie rod. Oh, wait, I just lost a, the nut came off. Wait, hold on. Yeah, look, the nut came off. Wow, that's super loose. Why is that so loose? Can I run something back to the house to see if you have, do you have any? I found this washer. This doesn't go on the bottom under that, or above that nut, does it? Yeah, it goes above the top. Where was this at? Come on, group search for my missing nut. I was literally about to take that tire off. When I was greasing, I was like, wow, if I had taken it off, I would have seen that it was loose and I would have tightened it. All right. I'm driving home. I'll catch you guys later. You gonna ride with me for the rest of the day? No, I'm gonna go find a nut and I'll catch up with you guys. Okay, I'm not gonna hold you up all day. Bye, Kyle. Bye. Oh, steering's getting loose. I'll try to fix this as quick as possible so I can get back out there. <sighs> Cue the elevator music while I fix my stuff. Hi, Peppa. Now get in the house. Uh, Alright, fine, you're coming with me then. <laughs> I know you want to play. Come in the garage. So I didn't necessarily break anything. I just had that come out. So we need to find some of that thread pattern. Right, 15 millimeter impact gun. We're just going to see if this is the right nut. Oh, it's not either. Worst case scenario, we got to make a trip to the hardware store. Alright, so now we're running up to Lowe's. Um, we went to Cody's, did that. Peppa wanted to go back in the house, and now she's coming with us to Lowe's. We're gonna go find a nut real quick, and then we'll get back up with the guys on the trail. Got the correct nut. Oh. I'm gonna put this on. It's a phone call. Grayson. Hello. Hey, have you talked to anybody? No, I'm not. Okay, well, the cops are here. Oh, interesting. Like, I mean, I've always been one to just talk to the police. I don't care. I'm. That's what we've been doing is just hanging out. Nobody ran. Well, interesting. So apparently there's some cops out on the golf course. Where the hell? Peppa! Alright. So it sounds like the squad talked to the cops. They basically just said, hey, stay off the gas line because one of the neighbors called. Which is fine. We don't need to be on there. We got plenty of other places to ride. An hour ago, the farthest I made it was this tree. We're not jumping that tree again. Actually, I should have. So on last week's ride, on the way home, me and Cody took a wrong turn and ended up like on that dump site. We started trying to get to the top of it, which is cool. And Cody freaking rolled his renegade and almost flipped down that hill. I guess my GoPro was dead, it was dark, but on Snapchat I was posting it. And he flipped it like twice. I had to get up above him, winch him back over, stand him up and we had to slowly lower him down and then I had to get off the hill. And it was just kind of one of those situations, the bike rolled over, he jumped up under it to catch it. Honestly, I thought it was crushing him, I ran over to help him. He's like, nah, I'm holding it, I'm holding it, just start winching it up. But yeah, it could have been really bad. Now, this is why everybody keeps telling me, get an exhaust, get an exhaust. Yes, exhausts, they sound great, this bike sounds like a little electric quad. But when you have a stock exhaust, you can kind of sneak around in the woods and the cops don't hear you coming from a mile and a half away. Now, if you just ride at mud parks all the time, then it don't matter, but we don't always ride mud parks. Let's see if we see them. Yeah, they're up there. I see them already. They're up right over there through the woods. I'm just going to go right on past them, unless they pop out right here, but I'm not going that way. Oh, they didn't. They... Oh, don't know what I just hit. Yeah, I mean, they didn't come out after me. They had their chance. It's not my fault they're in a golf cart. <laughs> they're better off in a Honda. Come on now. What are they gonna do? Chase me down the mud trail? Because they'd make it probably about right here. And they ain't making it through any of this on a golf cart. I'm only in two wheel drive. Now these boys moving quick. Next week, we're all going to be there. It's going to be November uh, 13th, 14th, 15th. Uh, we will be at performances for a meet and greet. Look, they're right up here. I see the water moving, catching up. Anyway, November 13th, 14th, and 15th. Woo. 
I don't know if I'm good. I don't know, don't care. Hi guys! I made it back! Gertie! You want to tug? I might be able to back out. I haven't even hit a single hole yet and I'm already the second muddiest. Yeah, I, I drove right by them. They were sitting there. I was going to stop and talk, but they never, like, they never moved. All right, so yeah. Next week, Performance East, we're doing a fan meetup at Performance East on Saturday during the noon. Sunday, we're doing a fan ride at Busco Beach in Goldsboro, North Carolina. Uh, be there or be square, because it's going to be a good time. Hey, are you going to be at Performance East now? I'm going to be at Performance East. With, you know who else should be at Performance East? All the fans! Give him a love tap. <laughs> Y'all hang back. I'm going to go under the bridge and come back and make sure nobody's over there. Oop. Yep. Uh, looks clear. Alright, right, I'm over by the pond. That water's looking turned up. Look, that's about as deep as it can get. You can only storm drains right here once it gets any deeper. Oh, so this is like four foot right here. Uh, oh, I can't even touch right there. Would not want to fall on that. I think my belt's getting ready to go. Yeah, she might be time about 600 miles, 100 hours on this bad girl. Woo! Boy. Hey, where? Oh! Oh! I think my belt's going. I heard some pretty hefty hunks and clunks earlier, and he has a tool. It would only take me a few minutes to change it, but I'm gonna go till it breaks. Please have a belt. Uh, that's for brute force. Uh, I'm pretty sure this is a cannon belt. BRP, baby! Let's go! Money! Money, money, money! Woo! Oh no, boys. Well, the belt's fine. But the case, the case is not fine. Okay, I don't know what I hit. Ooh. I don't know what I did. But. It, the belt looks okay. I mean, it doesn't look, well, yeah, it looks okay. That, that, that is not good. You can't say you ain't never seen no ghetto repair like I'm about to show you. This is straight up MacGyvering. I don't think it's gonna work and I don't care if it's gonna work. I'm just trying to ride today. I'm not gonna go in the mud. Just wanna ride, but I wanna keep the dirt out. So we got a little, just using what I had in my truck. So some freaking, pipe glue, which I don't know why is in my truck, but it is. This is when I bought some goggles the other day. Stick that on there, hold that for a second. And then of course I don't have no duct tape, normal electrical tape. Oh, come on. All right. Now we're gonna go around and around. I think I need to turn this in for warranty, but oh well, can't am. I need to make something better than this. Stop putting plastic. That's gonna get hit by metal or rocks or whatever the hell I hit it with. Woo. All right. So just like that, you have your customization. And just like that, you too can redneck repair your belt box. Cody asked for a traffic cone. I have no idea why. Kind of scares me that he wants a traffic cone. But we're gonna go find out. Anyway, I don't know why I'm getting a traffic cone. Um, but I am. Alright, so with the power of Redneck and Nation, and... Thank you. <laughs> yeah, you want to... It's like a wave pull up in here! 
under holy crap <laughs> that's it I'm dead oh everyone waited all right that's what let's get our picture <laughs> hey, ready? <laughs> you want to do bad? Let's go. Hey! You was about to run over this, dude. Give me my body. It's a shad. Put it back in there. Don't hit me. This. <laughs> no. <laughs> Let me do it to somebody else. Go get free. <laughs> All right, we're gonna go get her. Yo, you remember? Wait, wait. Wait, remember when we were at the pipeline hole and I threw the frog in your waders? <laughs> Don't throw the fish! Super wet belt though. boys four high
it is with the Outlander. Going under the bridge. I want to go play in there one day. Whoa, it's low right here. Look at how low that is. Well, it has been an eventful ride at Cody's as usual. I, uh... Ow! Put a big old hole in my belt box. What else do I do? Oh, broke a tie rod. Had some good sends with the boys. Uh, I still need to fix my rag kit. I'm gonna go around this. But, best of all, I got to see my friends. What do you think of today's ride? You didn't ride, you didn't break shit. You just had a good time. I'm the one who broke everything. Yeah, exactly. Two minutes break it and then freaking. That's fucking epic though. We both came and jumped over the log. Oh yeah. And then your shit was wait, wait, wait. I hold on. I broke it two minutes into the ride and then literally as soon as I caught up to you, right when I got up behind it, that's when I broke the belt box. Yeah. Ooh. Can't win today. Cannot win today, boys. But hey. It was still a hell of a day. Still better than being at work. It would be the icing on the cake if I found the broken piece of belt box. I think it's up here somewhere. Or that's at least where I broke it. Who knows if it fell off right there. I got my eyes open for it though, I'm looking. It's probably at the bottom of a mud hole somewhere. Ugh. Oh, belt's wet. It might be time for a 2021 now, guys. This poor girl. Nah, we're gonna fix her. I know, I would love to trade her in on a fresh unit, but I can't give up on her yet. She's still getting broken in. She only got 600 miles on it. Keep it quiet for the police. Yeah, when I was coming through, he was sitting right up there and I came driving by and I kept looking for him. Like I saw him and I was looking, but he never like even moved and I came here and I looked up at him and he never moved, so. <laughs> Come on, do your guy a favor. Why didn't you let him ride the Polaris today? I didn't want to. I didn't want to shut off every five seconds. Yeah, that's a good point. He didn't want the Polaris problems. Alright guys, I'm closing this video out. It has been a real one. We had the whole gang out here today. It was uh, 13 of us total. It was a killer ride, but we'll catch you on the next one. Woo! Later.